welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be showing you how I got these braids. So it is a whole, you know, week, week late. <laughs> That's why my braids look so old. But I'm going to show you guys how I got my extra long, I think I could call them or should call them bohemian braids. Um, honestly, I'm going to let y'all know this real quick and real simple. I had no template on what I was doing with my hair until I actually just started doing it. Um, so I'm just going to show y'all my process of me doing these braids. Um, they're super long. I'm going to, sorry y'all, I'm a little naked. I'm going to show you guys how long they are. As y'all can see, you can't even see where they end. Let me show you. It is a lot past my booty. Um, here's the side view. Y'all can see how long it is there. Um, these are some super extra long braids. Um, a lot of people have been asking me about them. So I was like, why not just make a video? So here is, you know, as detailed as I can get it. Again, I had no template of what I was doing until I was doing it. So these braids, uh, hopefully this tutorial makes you or helps you get these braids or the look that you're going for. Um, but yeah, really all I was doing was freehanding. So I'm going to show you my process. Um, so yeah, here's how I got them. Hey you guys, so here you guys can see that I had just parted my sister's hair at Oiler Scout real, real good, twisted them up so I can get out of my way. But yeah, this is literally my beginning process. I like to do edges, perfect parting, and moisturizing before I even start these braids so they can come out to be super seamless and just, you know, neat and perfect. So here, I'm showing you guys the hair that I used. Um, I'm using her natural hair color, but I got the crochet hair, you know, the curly crochet hair. It doesn't matter what type of curl you get. Um, I just like the wavy curl. And then I'm just using regular braiding hair. I believe I got about like seven to eight packs of braiding hair and one pack of crochet hair. I'm sorry if y'all can hear my sister upstairs. <laughs> um, but yeah. So once I take the um, crochet hair out, I like to pull on it, you know, basically try to stretch it a little bit um, before I take it out. But what I'm doing here now is just measuring out my braiding hair and just the crochet hair and seeing how much of each that I want to use. With the braiding hair, I also like to stretch that out as well. So basically what I'm doing is pulling on the ends of the hair as you see me do right now. And that's basically gonna make the ends like uneven so you don't have like a blunt cut. And it's like, you know, a little extra lengthy. But as you see, I'm measuring out the pieces. And I, once I get the free tress hair, I measure out how much I want. I split that in half. And please be careful when you do this because it tangles so easy. So you have to do this very softly to get that curl. If you lose that curl, all I do is like twist it up again with my fingers as you guys will probably see me do in this video. And usually what I do is I use the smaller piece to add in the braid. As you guys are going to see me use this piece while I braid. I usually add that in the braid and the thicker piece to the end. But as I start my braid, what I'm going to use is my Eco Styler Gel. And then, you know, that's going to help me smooth out her natural hair with the braiding hair. And in a second, you guys are going to see me place the curly piece. So I'm a little bit in the way. As y'all can see, I'm starting to braid. And I'm dividing each piece of hair within each other. And once I get to a certain spot I like to place the curly hair so honestly how I place my curls are super random before I put the curls in I like to put the eco styler in to keep you know her natural hair smooth in the braid um, how I hold it is I have someone hold the curly hair as I'm braiding so it doesn't get lost in the braid because it definitely will and I keep on going in with the Eco Salad Gel to smooth her hair out to make this just a natural 
very smooth braid but yeah my whole template for this was very random as y'all can see um i just pull it out where i think it'd be cute and yeah that's just exactly how i did it just like that So these braids are already super long so the extra hair just makes it a little bit longer and as I get towards the end of the braid I just add the free tress hair in there and braid it all the way through and I blend it with the eco styler gel and that is it. Um, I'm going to show you guys one more braid that I did just to show you you know an example um, but yeah I hope you guys understand it because <laughs> it's a little hard to explain but yeah i hope you guys get the gist of the entire video look of when I did it to my hair but it is the same exact process as what I showed you guys um so yeah this is what I got thank you guys for watching and coming to my channel I hope you guys enjoyed this I hope this was easy to follow or understand don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video bye Hey, 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 be on the track, yeah.